Well, we're hundreds of miles away from any racetrack today. We're actually at the Fuchs Lab. That's why I've got my safety glasses on to find out about a secret weapon that Phil Lamartine has been using that no other car has in the top fuel field. It's especially designed all from Fuchs, all for him. The journey, you know, started seven years ago. You know, I would call it a relationship. Pretty much helps our team by being able to work together with the lab guys um, on the technical side of things where, you know, we might see after, you know, a couple of runs, uh, see what the oil's doing and they were able to specifically develop the oil for top fuel drag racing. So to be able to have that opportunity is quite unique. The brand new Fuchs Lab in Melbourne is a multi-million dollar research facility where Fuchs tirelessly work in the pursuit of quality control of all their oils. Today they throw open their doors to display all their high-tech toys. And along with Lamartina, they've also invited some big V8 supercar stars. Lamartina taking a chance to sign a few autographs. You're next to Jason Bright at the moment, having a bit of an argument maybe over who would win the race at Turn 1. <laughs> uh, no, not quite. <laughs> We'd, yeah, I'd get there first, but after that I think I'd be gone. I think I'd run out of fuel. So after a few posters were signed, the drivers were treated to a tour. Pretty fortunate to come here today and, and see uh, Fuchs's new facility. Um, you know, it's obviously a big part of what we do. We want reliability and, um, and the best oil that's out there. And you know, we're lucky that you know, they've already been providing us great oil. And I think we've got some better oil to come. It's a perfect connection for us. Obviously, um, Stone Brothers Racing build build our own motors in house. We've got a really really nice uh, engine shop, and to have a partnership with Fuchs and be able to develop the oils which go into our engines together, especially for our V8 supercars, is, is fantastic and a great tool to have. See, when I was in high school, I was always one of those kids getting kicked out of science class for starting fires and mixing chemicals that I probably shouldn't. But I'm here with Calissa, and she's a trainee here at Fuchs. Calissa, tell us a little bit about uh, your work here in this plant. Um, OK, I'm the trainee. I'm a QC chemist, so meaning that any blend that comes in from production, I test, and it's really fun, and work environment's great, and I've learnt quite a lot in my two years of being here, so... And you haven't dropped any important chemicals yet or started any fires? None that I'll disclose on TV. <laughs> <laughs> this is the instruments room here at the Fuchs Lab and they've got so much cool stuff in here, stethoscopes and computers, and they test the oil for absolutely everything. What we see in front of us, though, they're doing temperature tests, so extreme hot temperatures, extreme cold temperatures, making sure that that Fuchs oil is still working. Now, we've all heard that saying, they don't mix like oil and water. Well, here at the lab, they've even got machines that prove that, that saying is absolutely correct. There's a whole bunch of machines, and it's well way over my head to tell you the truth, so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go back to learning those good old elements. The periodic table. Carbon, beryllium? I don't know.